what up y'all so next up man we got Javante Davis versus Roly Romero we got your boy Roly aka G-Shock man taking on Tank man they in here doing a media workout and Roly looks to be in good shape but one thing we know about boxing man you can be in the best shape of your life but you can't train that chin again no better shape than what it's gonna be if you ain't getting used to getting punched a certain kind of way in the gym you definitely ain't gonna be able to take that shit come fight night especially from somebody like Javante Davis it's probably not a, a sparring partner Roley could find that can punch like Tank so it don't matter how how, how good of a shape he in but you know let's, let's, let's check him out though Look at, him. Look at him. Look at him doing all that bullshit just to get his head knocked off. He doing all that. Tank and, and, and Captain Ford sitting somewhere laughing at this shit. Like, look at this nigga, man. We, we gonna kill his ass. We gonna, we, gonna, we gonna tuck him in, man. We gonna put him to bed and tuck his ass in. But I'm telling you, bro, read him a bedtime story. Look at him. They ain't really working that hard. These niggas admiring they work too much. Every time he do something exciting, they walking around like, yeah, yeah, y'all see that? That shit for all cameras and action and shit. That shit is no different from Denzel Washington playing a training day. That's all this shit is, a fucking act. Because come fight night, it ain't a wrestling move, UFC move he gonna be able to do to dodge some of them fucking uppercuts that he gonna be getting hit with, man. Tank coming in on some whole other shit, bro. You know, we all know that Roley, aka G Shock, just don't possess he just don't possess the, the skill level to even fuck with Tank. He don't. But all this shit do look good though. You know. Him and his Booker T. Washington looking at us, trainer. These niggas just doing whatever. Look at they admiring their work. Look at walking around. Looking at everybody and shit. Like, what you doing, man? Keep working. Y'all admiring the work, man. Keep on working, bro. Caught up in the hype. No now. Sure, sure, Looking at the camera, they too distracted by the attention. That they ain't even focused on the work that much. Like you can just tell a lot of shit before the fight even happens. See, I always point out these type of things. I did the same thing with Danny Garcia. Leading up to the Earl Spence fight. When he was in the gym, he was too busy looking in the mirror. He, he was looking in the mirror after every time he threw a combination. Just to see how pretty he looked. That's where a lot of this shit be coming from with these fighters, man. They be trying to look pretty too much. And then they get in the ring, get beat up, and then they looking ugly. So all the pretty shit was for nothing. <laughs> it was for nothing. Because cause Tank gonna make you look ugly. I'm telling you. Yeah. Every time he punches, he made that word, word at. <laughs> oh man, I can't, I can't get enough of this shit, man. This shit funny. It looking for you on high TV. I'm subscribed to you too, bro. This is just my work phone, so don't think I ain't subscribed to you and, and playing your video and shit. I'm definitely subscribed and all that, so. But look how I fight, how you title it. Scary. Roly Romero, bone crushing power. Explosive one hitter, quitter. KO shots. Man, that shit ain't gonna mean nothing, bro. This dude ain't got no defense. You know, Tank got the skills and he got the athleticism. And he got the power. 
They got the whole package. He come with everything, man. Tank the type to come with the he coming with the Glock with all the attachments on it. He showing up with the Glock with all he got. He even got the switch on. He got the switch on the Glock. He got the red dot, the beam, and the extended clip. Rolly, he show up with a fucking 380. <laughs> a fucking stolen firearm that jam up on your ass. <laughs> 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 Yeah, look, mind the work again. It's a book of peace. Fucking hype, man. That's exactly what it is. Some WWE shit, man. After every combination, they walk around and look at everybody. Yeah, see that? See that? <laughs> These niggas some fucking clowns, man. Look at that work. He's still walking around. Work. Look at him. All for the attention. Everybody clapping and shit. It's all good, though, because ain't nobody going to clap once Tank knock his head off. Ain't nobody going to clap. Well, they team won't. I like how he popping that drum, but... If you look at how his trainer coming at him, his trainer coming at him from the orthodox position. He ain't even, he ain't even mimicking how how uh, Javante Davis fight. He ain't even, Tank is a fucking southpaw, bro. Just look at his coach real quick. Now he switched to the southpaw. These niggas some fucking clowns, bro. Look, I'm walking around already. That's all they worried about. The attention and the hype. At the end of the day, they gonna have to scoop Rolly up off the floor. Cause he ain't got enough for Tank, bro. I'm just saying, I'm just letting it be known, man. Tank gonna destroy this dude. Y'all hit that like button and subscribe to the channel if you ain't subscribed already. To people who ain't used to watching, you know, guys train and hit pads, they probably think this is just some cold ass shit they ever seen. But we're going to see some cold shit come fight night. Shit going to be getting real brutal. Y'all hit that like button, subscribe, and I'm out, y'all deuces.